What is up guys, this is me, Johnny Cooper 64 here with another YouTube video, and the latest and final Grand Prix of 2019 has released last week, and isn't it amazing? Yaya, Rillaroo, Chick, Stu, and Hasty has been released, ending 2019 with a bang. I'm surprised Beanox has been supporting the game longer than Nintendo did with Mario Kart 8, and definitely Team Sonic Racing from Sega. Anyways, as always, our data miner, Beta M, has data mined the game and found the following in the game's coding. Season 7 Driver, Driver MMX. Mega Mix. A driver entry called Driver Who Am I was added but not linked to any season yet. Season 7 cards Dusty Raider, Desert Duster, The Nuke. A promotional card entry called Card Limited 4 was added. New mask power up code named APO, A P E O. Season 7 legendary skins Coco, Cortex, Crash, Dingo Dao, Mega Mix has the legendary skin. Nina, Engine, Polar, Pura, and Tiny. And none of these skins have like the specific name but we all know these characters are gonna have the skins for that season season 7 wheels codenamed mad new unlock message added beat all of ctr and cnk developers time trials three new challenges added placeholder beat developer goes placeholder beat developer goes track name a and the same for the other one so first off we are getting a mega mix i think half of you guys know who this character is but for those who never owned the game boy game that is crash huge adventure this individual is a combination of neocortex Dinko Dao, Tiny, and Engine, after collecting all the gems, we have like an alternative ending, the true ending I guess you can say, where they transform into one huge monster-like form and become the true final antagonist of the game. I always liked the design, not gonna lie, I just never thought it was gonna be back after all these years, I thought it was just like a one-time thing. An obscure character as well, I shall say, but he was playable in Entrance, multiplayer minigame, which is why I think they brought him back. I can't wait to see how this monster looks like in the Nitro Fuel form. Now, we have this this other character whose name is Driver Who Am I. This confirms that Beanox knows that Beta M has been data mining the game and is now codenaming the characters that they want to keep a secret. Which is disappointing, but hey, at least now it's a surprise. Mega Mix will have been a big surprise as well. But Johnny, why didn't they codename him that as well? They probably finished coding his name with the Mega Mix name and couldn't redo all the coding and kept it like that. And when they started working on the other character, they sugar coded it so no one will know. Which means this will most likely be the last data mine as they'll hide all the names encoded with random names and as they are now aware of the leaks. So who can this driver who am I be? We're getting Mega Mix and that marks the end of the characters for the GBA games. The DS version only has one antagonist left and that is Viscount, the main antagonist in Crash Bash, the most lowest rated Crash game and the most hated game in the Crash community. But he has been requested to be a Nitro Field for his unique design and why waste it in the bad game? Redeem him in one of the best Crash games made. Which which is why I think he's gonna be in the top two of being the mysterious character in the data mine. It's either him or Velo. Now, Robot Velo might be the other character, and since there's only two characters in the data mine, what if they're adding the CNK story and that's why they're only adding two characters plus the new track? It's very possible. The theme of the new track is inspired by Mad Max, which I predicted days ago. I called it, folks. The post apocalyptic desert with cars. Who else but the movie series Mad Max? Also, we're getting beat all of CTR's CNK developers' time trial mode. Oof, not again. This could mean that either the mysterious character is locked behind this. So if Robot Velo is in this, you will have to beat the developer's time trials. I've mastered the time trials and shown be hard, but will the trials be harder than trophies or oxide is what I'm wondering. What do you guys think? We have new challenges being added with the developer's ghost. We get a promotional card like the plain one and Sour Patch Kids and the Breath Mint one. Interesting to see what it is. It seems Mega Mix is the protagonist of this Grand Prix. Maybe Beanox hit more characters being in the Grand Prix and we're getting actually for. So, what if we don't get the CNK story and instead the mysterious character is Evil Crash and the other two are the evil twins. This will be a great idea since Twin Sanity World is deserty and looks very much like an apocalyptic version of Insanity Beach. So that's an idea there which I also predicted months ago and even said it will be released in January. Also the final thing we are getting is a special mask, power up code named APO. Now the leaks behind the new Crash game still holds up despite not being announced in the Game Awards, Savy and the other leakers never said it was being announced that day. We the fans just speculated it because you know of last year's reveal. So this character could be the man 
mask we saw in the PlayStation advertisement with the lunar features, while also being a promotional character for the next installment in the Crash series, with the new Crash game being announced in January, along with the Grand Prix reveal. It'll be like they reveal the new Crash game first, and then they release the Grand Prix after that, and show the mask as a promotion to the game to tie in it. Maybe we have to pre-order the new Crash game to unlock the mask, who knows? Unless the mask is not the one featured in the ad, and is another original mask made by Beanox, or the elementals being added one by one in the final Grand Prix. Which versions do you guys like better? What are your thoughts on Mega Mix? Who's the mysterious character? Let me know in the comment section below, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.